have you had a chance to analyze uh, Mitchell Agood, the linebacker? Yes, the UCLA linebacker. See, here, yeah. here's my thing. Here's my thing. I trust this for the, for the first time in I don't know how long. I can say I trust this staff. He seems to be – we're recruiting him and going after him. I'm not trying to shortchange it. But I think we should do exactly what I said earlier this week. Mark, let's think about it like this. You asked Cam a question, right, about two five-star offensive linemen who hit the portal just last week. After last week, a week ago today – we had this same conversation, and I said to you, Miami should pause, wait, because once all the spring games are done, a bunch of those five stars who feel like they should be playing are going to hit the portal. I believe, be it from Ohio State, be, and that usually doesn't happen a lot, but Georgia, Bama, LSU, they're going to be these elite prospect linebackers who are going to hit the portal if we just stay if steadfast, if we just hold on a little bit. We lost a couple young men, one specifically in Tyreek Austin Cave, linebacker to the transfer portal. We also lost a running back in Cody Brown to the transfer portal. I believe Tyreek Austin Cave is going to go up either – to a bigger school in the Big Ten or going to go to Rutgers and just kick ass. I think he's a good player. I really think he's a good player. Not the most athletic, so the Big Ten is perfect for him as far as being able to sit in that middle backer, take on pulling guards, and pull up on running backs. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Cody Brown, I don't really know where he can go. I mean, I think he can go to Tennessee, former commit to Tennessee, and then got out of his – his deal and came to Miami. So we'll see. But uh, I think, well, we will have more of that people leaving, which means that we are going to have more scholarship openings uh, for us to be able to take on more. So again, we're going to work both of those, you know, both ends of that spectrum. People are going to go out, which means we'll have more room to bring people in. And who's to say you don't bring in the UCLA guy and one of those big time SEC uh, five star linebackers come in and you know, there's a familiar name being talked about again with Miami. So we'll see, you know, you know, just in case. We'll 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 see if he if he wants to come and be a king. A good racked up 55 tackles, six and a half tackles for loss, two sacks last season. 